It's a done deal. The hugely controversial TPPA has been finalised, despite nationwide protest. The latest local opposition rally was held just last week. Prime Minister John Key thinks residents will come to see the benefits, but local activists aren't convinced. My response really would be, OK, well, let's see the facts. Um, we know that the government will be wanting to put a positive spin on the TPP. Um, they're very good at that, but we don't believe that they can back that up with facts. When the text of the TPP comes out, that's when we'll see um, what's really in it. One of the major hold-ups during negotiations was to do with dairy tariffs. Almost all tariffs for New Zealand will be eliminated under the deal, with some exceptions. Other parts of the agreement are still under wraps. Well, the secrecy obviously is a big issue because it just means that we don't know the full details. But what we do know, we know enough about to know that um, there are serious worries. The government's got 30 days to release the full TPPA text, but there's concern that not all relevant information will be made public. Part of the TPP agreement itself um, says that they don't have to be released for four years after it's signed. So again, pointing out that um, the secrecy around this deal means that New Zealanders are signing up to something they won't know what it is for a number of years even. The United States and Canada still plan to debate the deal in-house. Calls are being made for that to happen in New Zealand, but there's no plan to do so at present. Ruby McAndrew, 39, Dunedin News.